Welcome, I'm Danielle Lin, and I'm here with Dr. Armar Khan from the Harley Street Skin Clinic, and we're talking about anti-aging. And there's so much in this short period of time. You were saying something to me about the history of what happened in skin care and where we are today. Can you just go over that a bit? Yeah, sure, Danielle. Back in the 80s, we were using human growth factors, but they were coming from placenta. And this is the afterbirth, and they were going off to the uh, companies to be used in cosmetics. In the late 80s, there was a Human Tissue Act which stopped all that. So that stopped all the active ingredients going into something like Pond's Cream. Yeah, we were talking about that. With every grandmother, they took Pond's Cream and they had great skin and everybody wondered what happened. So they took those, skin, those factors out yeah. and now where are we? Have we made a progress to come back from that? Well, science has progressed over the last 30 years to take us back to where we were then. And the ingredients that we're using now are active. So okay. we've synthesized so human growth factors. So could it be factors. a plant by botanicals and things? So when we go through this, like we're standing in a bar, <laughs> it doesn't make much sense when it comes to great skin, but the idea here is how do we create a skin cocktail? When we go, or I as a woman go and I look at products, what do I need to see in these products? What am I looking for on that label? A couple of the ingredients. Sure. I think one of the things that's important is to turn over the skin and get rid of the dead skin, which looks dull and old. And AHAs, alpha hydroxy acids, and polyhydroxy acids are very good for that. The second thing to look for are nourishing factors, so growth factors, and peptides are very, very good. And the third thing to look for is an antioxidant which protects the skin. So when you're, when, you're, when you're doing, you're spinning, you're looking at the labels, like you take a product like this and you say to yourself, I'm going to turn it around, I'm going to look on the label and I'm going to look to see if it has the ingredients most important, not just necessarily a, a famous brand name. And they will be more effective. I know you mentioned when we were talking earlier about the idea that they may be expensive. Yeah, absolutely. And that's down to the research that goes behind them now. Um, you know, products are becoming more scientifically produced. For example, um, this product here is a stem cell based product which is based on a patented stem cell which has research behind it so there's lots of science behind that that costs a lot of money so that has to be recouped in the cost of the product yeah so the idea is that it may be expensive but you want it to be effective so if you're going to look for a product and if you want more information go to myfacemybody.com because that's where you start when you know what you're looking for because you have education it'll make a difference in your life so good to have you here. Thanks for being with us. It's been a pleasure.